today we're going to look at the controversial so communism is in minecraft now by this imbecilic minecrafter willy the worm underscore from first glance this video doesn't look to be much so the other day i was just reading the communist manifesto and i had this thought what if minecraft was communist and i thought wait minecraft needs to be communist excuse me minecraft does not need to be communist and the more I thought about it, the more I realized Minecraft has these big issues that need to be fixed. Yeah, Minecraft does have a lot of issues. Why do you think communism is going to fix this liberal crap? Like, let's just start in the menu screen. Look at this. The Minecraft main screen is iconic. Why is this the first issue taken? Look at all the- oh, oh, this is disgusting. Look, Minecraft. Minecraft? Like, it's yours? Is this just yours or mine? No, it's everyone's. Why can't it just be one person have the mine of the craft? Oh, I see. This is just a dumb, sarcastic joke. Come on, act professional. Go back to AP history, you band kid. And look, single player? Why would you not play with your comrades? And Minecraft realms, ugh. Oh. That is literally just capitalism. And look at these villagers. Look, trading for goods? They're trying to... Th th this is capitalism. Trading is mercantilism, not capitalism. You intellectual fraud. I just can't stand for this, guys. So I've just gone ahead and started with the title screen. I'll go ahead and fix everything else in a second. This main menu looks ugly. The R doesn't even fit with the text and all the buttons, but one is blank? But let's just look at this. Honestly, this is just so much beautiful. Look, our craft. Everyone can have it. It's everyone's. Also, yeah, I had to remove single player because, yeah, look, it's not even an option anymore. Just because why wouldn't you play with your comrades? Because you need to play with everyone. You can't just play by yourself. What could you be doing by yourself over there? You need to be part of the community. Single player is fun, too. But yeah, Minecraft Realms, yeah, that's just capitalism. Of course it had to be removed. Options, too. No, no options anymore because it's everyone. Something, I don't know. And quit game? Yeah, of course, no leaving. Duh. I mean, why would you want to leave anyway? This goes to show the dystopian implications of communism. How could anyone agree with this? But even with those changes, we're nowhere close to fixing this. Also, yeah, I changed my skin. I thought it was pretty necessary change. But yeah, anyways, guys, take a look at this. Look at this. This, all this individuality? Why would you need to express yourself and be, express your differences when you are all one community? Oh, this, this is, I just can't stand for this. Guys, now look at this. This is true art. Look at this. Okay, this would be based if it was replaced with America First art. Joseph Stalin. Joseph Stalin. Oh, there he is again. Oh. Oh, look, it's Karl Marx. Oh, look, a perfect example of the true communist worker. Oh, look, it's the space race, too. Yes, supports the Soviets in the space race. This isn't propaganda. This is... <sighs> hey, hey, look, it's Karl Marx. Also, guys, books. What kind of information could you be spreading with a book? Like, why do people even need books? So I made it so that every single book becomes... The Communist Manifesto, the only book anyone would even want to read. This video is obviously a troll meant for edgy middle schoolers. How unprofessional. Up next, we have Minecraft, but the six stages of being transgender by Al Toriel P Official, whatever that means. Okay, so we're going to tank the image of Minecraft, a kids game with transgenderism. Okay, cool. Got it. Don't even get me started on that B. <sighs> trans B? They put trans B in Minecraft? They have the balls to put one of the greatest video games of all times, a trans B? Uh oh. Cut, cut, <laughs> cut. <laughs>